Hey guys, what's up, Daniel here. Today we're taking a look at the white iPhone 11. And uh, let's check this out. Let's just get straight into this thing. It retails for $700 for a 64 gigabyte version. And uh, here it is, white back, silver sides, plastic on the front, easily removable. Inside the box, we are gonna get just the pamphlets and uh, Apple stickers, SIM eject tool, nothing special. Here again, same charger as last year or the previous years. Same headphones, ear pods as the previous years and same cable as the previous years as well. So nothing different for the iPhone 11. The Pro is getting a fast charger included along with USB type C to lightning. But uh, aside from that, pretty much the exact same things we've, uh, oh, whoops, gotten in the previous years. And the box right there, you can see it. iPhone, silver on the sides, white top, nothing quite special. They kind of reserved the special boxes for the Pros as you can see here all black, but yeah, here is the silver, or not the silver, the white color for the iPhone 11. And uh, silver sides looking real nice. They have a slight sheen to them. Doesn't look bad, looks really good. The back is uh, mm, pure white, maybe? Yeah, it's really close to pure white. On camera, it looks a heck of a lot brighter white than it does on uh, here in real life the way I'm looking at it. However, of course, it all depends on the lighting situations. That's why I'm gonna do a color comparison like last year, showing it to you guys with all the different colors and different lighting conditions. So we'll do that in a future video. You can see it there though. I mean, it's as simple as it gets. It's a white color. You have silver edges around the camera here. It's still matted out white here for the camera bump. The sides are silver. Let's go ahead and put this guy in a clear case so you guys can see that. There you go. That looks pretty good. I think all these phones really do benefit from a clear case. Look really good. You can see that there. We'll be taking a look at Apple's clear case in one of the next videos once we unbox all these. That way you guys can see that one, but this is just kind of like a gel case. I'll have the link down below in the description to these. And uh, yeah, this one in particular is from Subcase. This one right here is from Totally. Both brands that I recommend, cool companies. And here you have it with a very, very minimal case. This is about as minimal as I get. There are some slightly thinner cases that are kind of even more paper thin than this. I would honestly not buy the ones that are like $10. Sometimes the $16 ones, $20 ones that are slim are have a slightly better plastic than those. And I'm not, you know, sponsoring this company or anything, just that is my experience with all those, but you can see that phone right there. Looks really good with the white, of course. I think, you know, if you like a white color for a phone, you can't be disappointed by this white color. They're not doing anything weird this year like they do, or they have done in the past with the uh, 10 and the 10S, which is like a cloudy white that I hate. So, you know, the 10R and this one, even though I think this one still looks better, like all these colors look better than the 10R. You know, if you have a 10R in white, this is definitely not gonna look worse. If anything, it might look better. So that is worth noting. And uh, just as a quick comparison, there you go. This is the white and the red right there. Looking really good, both of them. And let's go ahead and try to do this here. Let's give you a sneak peek of all the colors here. So you guys can see that. Yeah, you know, I think it's pretty straightforward. If you if you kind of like white, you can go for this and you're really gonna like it. It's a nice white color. I think overall, those uh, lenses on the back, they look pretty good. I think they designed it the best that they could, given the situation that they wanna put so many lenses on the back. But there you have it, guys. The white color in the iPhone 11, as well as the purple, the green, the yellow, and the red here. And I'm gonna go set these back here for the next video. Uh oh, there we go. Let's go ahead and set this one up here. And then I'll put the white like right here. And that'll be the start of the next video. But uh, yeah guys, that's pretty much it. If you guys have any questions, feel free to reach out to me and uh, let me know what you guys think about this white color. If you're gonna go with white or maybe one of the more spicy colors like these uh, colors here or the red, maybe the black. We'll check the black one out in the next video. But yeah, thanks for watching as always. And uh, I'll catch you guys in the next video. Goodbye.